Welcome back. In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you step-by-step -step instructions on how to set your default colors in the Divi theme. Let's jump into it. Alright, before we jump into it, if you're new to my channel, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon. Uh, what that will do is anytime I do a new video, uh, you will get notified when I launch and release that video. Also, if you wouldn't mind, drop a like for me. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave the comments down below in the comment box. Okay, so today we're doing the default colors for in the Divi theme. So on your dashboard, down on the left-hand side, at the very bottom, you have Divi, and when you hover over Divi, you're going to click on Theme Options. That's going to bring you to this window. So down here, we have the color default um, palette. Uh, what I recommend is you having two different shades of a black, two different shades of a white, and then two to four um, actual brand colors. This will help give you some diversity throughout your website so you don't have just one solid blue or one solid red just taking over the entire website. You want some sort of contrasting colors and some sort of make it appeasing on the eye. So for black, uh, we, don't do, we don't do pitch black, which is the hex code 000000. 000, 000, 000, 000, 000. What I like to do is all threes, and that's partly because three is my lucky number, So, uh, but it also looks good. It's a very charcoal, it's a little bit easier on the eyes, and it's just a natural looking color. So three, 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 three. Uh, then we do a light shade of more of a grayish look, and for this one, we're doing sevens across the board. So then for white, you have the complete white. You're, you're going to want to do 100% complete white. This will help blend into your background of your website, unless if you set it up as a box, but we can jump into that later. So for complete and 100% pure white, it is FFF, FFF. So right here, and we have that already set up for you in the easy blog in a box. Uh, then we do more of an off-white. And for this one, we just do F4, F4, F4. Or uh, another one I like to use is uh, F6 or F9. Repeating. So F9, F9, F9. Uh, then you get into your brand colors. And for the Easy Blog in a Box, we use a lot of orange. And then you can see this is the actual hex code for that orange that we use. Then you have some contrasting colors if you want to use those. You don't have to use all four of those, but it is, it's worth at least having them just so you can put them in there whenever you wish. So I think that's it for today. I appreciate you guys sticking with me to the end. And if you have any questions, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time.